<coughs> Cupid's arrow and the dream king. It is prefaced by two lines from Boris Pasternak. He washed the sun away like blood from a knife and just stood there looking strange. Remember, these poems are to free you for love, to break the spell death has cast over you. King Judah leans upon his hand and sighs. The infidels have crossed his borders. King Judah listens to the night wind outside his chambers. King Judah stares at the candle and feels tired of his life. The poem you wrote. Missing in this world a hole where you stood holding me. Hope to see you soon, felt your pelvis. I was going to write, but I didn't. Isn't the rain a relief? And the one you lived with sat there. I said, I'm about to walk out. I wanted to ask, what did it all mean? The guards outside the doors are half asleep held up only by their armor. King Judah's birds nod under their covers. The tower, too, is drowsy. It seems to lean as it points at the night sky, trying to find its name. <coughs> Blind keys on the piano, justice without words. A knife slices my soul up like fried onions. A cold in the nose, an ache in the groin, a moon cold and dumb as a stone. A table with withered flowers, a lamp that hisses, a cat that licks, stars so far away they seem like mistakes. A wind so dry and cool it doesn't know its own mind. Lights of cities burnt from white to orange, Despair left too long in the pot, the whistle of a tea kettle, hot milk, a feeling of lightness. Winter creeps up to the door disguised as dry leaves, dreams all night of where you would like to die, the pain in the back, an alarm clock that spits out its teeth, a desire to sleep, hope in a bottle, art, fame, life itself. You tear the sheets to shreds to bandage the night. King Judah rages. He drives his Maserati over bridges. He smashes through police barriers. He cries tears the size of buttons. King Judah rages. The infidels have captured his son. He burns his money on the stock exchange. He visits old women who scour his palms with Dutch cleanser. He assembles generals, tears them apart, and rebuilds his army. King Judah rages. The sea pulls back the bottles off its shores, and all the messages of lost sailors are lost forever. They drop like seashells into your sleep. Isn't it strange what we value most? does not exist. You and I, solid bodies all, we bump into things, get bumped, get bumped off, but what we value most can't be caught or bought or touched. You and I, weak vessels, may bleed, cry, tremble with terror, even speak, but what we value most is silent as a smile. You think you'll get it easy. Not on your life, you won't. You won't get it without shedding tears, without worry, without heartache. You won't suddenly walk into pennies one day and find it on sale. You won't reach beneath the bleachers for your hat after the game is over 
and find it lying among the empty popcorn bags. You won't turn over to throw the alarm clock against the wall and find it hot in your hand. Not on your life, you won't. King Judah is on the march. He has reached Berlin, Cape Town, Montevideo. He reaches up the Amazon and pulls out a plum. He has the Andes in his grip. He eats Ecuador for breakfast and munches on Mexico. He plays rock around the clock in New York and crunches peanuts in Montreal. King Judah moves. He marches on Tokyo and burns Vladivostok. He lives it up in Singapore and drops his pants in Calcutta. He has an appointment in Samara, but decides to spend the night in Tel Aviv. The residents are angry, but there's nothing they can do. King Judah goes swimming in the sewers of Tashkent and surfaces in Moscow. King Judah plants peonies in the grave of his childhood and sits like he was asphalt, laid to pave the way. He has ransacked the world, but his son remains in darkness. If I could love, really love, just once in my life, if I could just leap out of my body, fly once in my life, if I could say to fame, to hell with you, and fortune too, just once in my life, molten lava eating up the street. I was in the outfield, sweating in my uniform. A cry came out of the bleachers. I forgot to lift my glove, and got hit between the eyes. Love caught me unawares. I was driving down the freeway, looking for the Broadway turned off. A siren in red light flashed across my frame of mind, and burnt my view of things to a crisp. I was loves, and there was no turning back. Love caught me unawares. Love grabs my dish and begins to eat. I grab the dish back, but it's empty. Love grabs my shoes and walks all over me. I grab the laces and they break in my hands. Love grabs the steering wheel. We go off bridges and break into waves. I grab the wheel back to which I am bound. Love rises over my solitude, like the moon. I am pale as milk with spots of blood for eyes. Love has decided to tell my fortune. She sits me down at a table of flies and smashes my fingers one by one. Old gypsy moon, she plays with my broken fingernails until they form a word as mute as herself. My sniffles and coughs are the cries of love. My laughter in the movies is love getting her revenge. My speeches on politics tickle love, and she rolls over and bites me in my bank account. My dinners with my family are love's nightmares. She can't get enough out of the conversation and spreads herself out in letters over the whole year. Love doesn't like the way I shave. She foams around my mouth and slobbers on the mirror, messing up my image of myself. Love disagrees with my drinking. She trips me up when I try to be witty. Love lays in shame under my bed, shaggy as a rug. When I tell some other body I love it, love pulls herself out from under me. I go sprawling in a grave. Love showers pebbles down upon me as I cry for dear life. King Judah says, In all the world there's not one marigold to soothe my sorrow. King Judah says, Let your wives be taken from you, and your man children, and your girl children, and see how you feel. Love, why do you do this to me? I asked you for nothing. And still you give me this gift of great pain, this uneasiness, this desire that drives me out into the world. Love, I have asked you for nothing. Why do you do this to me? You have sharpened the wind. It cuts through my peace. You have boiled the sun like an egg. 
and I am so hungry I eat it. Trees pierce my feet like needles. I cannot walk but the way you wish me to, with my passion and my pain. I must walk into your open arms, love, bloody and dizzy. Love lay down like at the mountain range, and let me go galloping over her. Love was complacent, and said only the snow and the stones. Love rolled over me like the sea, and I became round and smooth. Love sucked me in her mouth to calm her thirst. Love tossed me out like a city on the sand, chasing me from street to street. She turned on her siren to let me know I was not forgotten. King Judah broods. I have been the king of everything, and nothing is worth anything. If you want to talk, it's all right. King Judah rolls over in his sleep. All the nightmares of his life rise like spines. He sleeps on the sea, and the further he falls, the better he feels. Name your disaster. I call mine love. I need a hurricane to free me from myself. An earthquake, thrown into the misery of others. I call it love. War for me. As we throw the bricks of blood and blow apart the house of the skull, I tremble with the fears of another and call it love. Name your disaster. I call mine love. Words and more words come pouring out. You can't stop them. You jam your whole body into the hole, but the flood goes on. The future washes over you after washing the dishes on which the past was served up. You reach for dessert and find it is death, and you go out on the porch and death rocks in the rocking chair watching the sun go down. You blow your nose and death comes running. Words and more words, death and more death. Oh, love, I looked for you everywhere, but they called you by another name, and that name was death, a disguise too deep for me. I failed to embrace you, love, when you went about in the world in that terrible shape, a blind egg without eyes. You came to me, love, and I did not know you. You had the look of a tramp, your nose runny, your face beaten up like an old tin can. You leered at me, love, through snot and dirt. You leaned against the wall and puked. Ah, love, hold on to me until I am ready. Even if I cry for freedom, it is my ignorance. Hold on to me, love, until I understand my own struggle. Let me go, love, and I will die of lies. I did what was easy, flowed through this world like water, down drains, through streets, over bodies. I carried trash on my back, boats, lovers. I carried the limitless dead and eyes full of pride. I did what was easy, blew through this world like smoke, assuming a shape and calling it conviction, assuming an attitude and calling it love. I did what was easy, a dark cloud raining on the grave. King Judah sleeps. The stars pop like blisters, as if he'd worn out the universe. And the moon sizzles like a pancake, and that's why it has burst bubbles. King Judah sleeps. You quiet the child with a lullaby. King Judah, King Judah, what will he do? If he doesn't eat me, he might eat you. Frogs in wells suddenly become princesses. Princesses in castles suddenly become frogs. You kiss the queen, and she kisses you back, and your love becomes bilge in the ship of state. O oh, King Judah, King Judah, our lands are in ruins. The infidels are crossing our borders. Why do you sleep so long?
I did not believe you until you became a body. I would not listen until you assumed a human voice. Now you punish me for my doubt. I never know who is speaking, the body or you. I never know who is telling the truth. This morning, love, I do not believe in you. I do not believe in your blue eyes, your blonde hair, your nervous active limbs. I do not believe in the looks you gave me, the promise of your body. I do not believe, love, in all I have given, taken. There is sand in the silence, and it wears away my eyes. I walk on the earth, and you are the earth. I put my hands against your body, and the moon gets hot. I aim my ambition at a distant planet, and messages come back like sighs. When I let you become the universe, I gave myself limits. I began to live, love. Even if I love, I would be the same, the stumbling, fumbling fool. Even if I loved, I would hesitate to throw myself in the flame. I would stand at the edge of the pool with perfect poise and never dive. I would walk on the water when nobody was watching. I would be shot from a cannon and stick my head in the lion's mouth, but be defeated so everyone would know I was human. I would start on an arctic exploration and discover the gold in my teeth before I got fifty feet. I would run for president and keep running. I would tour the world in a balloon full of hot air. No matter how much I loved, yes, love, I would remain what I am just for you. The birds of King Judah fly around his head. They carry advertisements for Synanon, Stope, and scientific deception based on political principles and the power of the ill. The guards have just bought new homes. One drives a Volvo, one drives a Mercedes, and the third saves his money for a Maserati. O oh, King Judah, well might you weep, but why do you sleep so long? What kind of a city is this? Everyone lies, the money phony, the maps out of date. I parked my car and somebody stole the tires. I asked for gas and got water. Every drop of rain that falls becomes a drop of blood. What kind of a city is this? the city called bliss or love. I was not made for love. Love made for those built like a tower of stone with a soul of brick. I was not made for love. I shattered like glass. I was not made for love. Love must have muscles and eyes that see in the dark. Love must be fearless and jump from burning ships into boiling oil. I was not made for love. I was not made for love. Love must roll like rubber tires through the silence. Love must not be afraid of empty horizons, nor of the cat's cry. No, I was not made for love. Love gets up after midnight to quiet a child. Love rises at dawn to clear away smoke from the new day. I was not made for love. No. I was not made for love. Love, I want to strike, get a spark, slam you. This passivity, this indifference, strike. I too consume, eyes so pale, so blue. The wise know what grows slowly. I expect too much, 
desire too much, dream too much. I leap onto your body to bridge the abyss. I need you so much I break you with my weight. I love your independence. Is that any reason I should throw away my own? When I loved you without reason, I gave you a taste of freedom. You leaped into my arms like a dying child. All poetry is love poetry. Love trying to break out and reveal its proper name. Oh, I've thought it all a mask for rage, but rage is love denied. Love is when you open your arms. We can't open our arms. Why are our tears so important? We save them like misers. Get a grip on yourself. They always say that at dangerous times in the movies. And we are all living in a dangerous time. We are all living in the movies. If you open your arms, someone will grab your balls and wallet. Someone will knock out your teeth and shoot you in the heart. You grip your body so tightly, you are a walking, talking cramp. Oh, how proud we are of our scars. We identify with our wounds. Anything may happen. Anything may invade us. To cry is to sound an alarm, to draw attention. We lose our anonymity. Mothers, little children, policemen, they all come running, and because of the cry, you cannot hide. Your humanity breaks out in those salty tears, betraying you, for you come from the sea like everyone else. They may put you in an asylum. They may put you in jail. Instead of being a famous poet, you'd be a famous madman. Instead of a free singer, you'd be a jailbird. You like to be given things but don't know how to receive. You are cold down to your toenail. This life you hold in your tightly closed fist. It is an accident. It came into the world and floundered around, the original impulse picking up a fluvia, bits and pieces from the tide of time, out of which it constructed a patchwork identity, because it wanted to be like other people. It wanted to have a home and a name. But are you free just because your prison goes with you? Love was shut up in a room to cry all night. Love was told not to play with itself. Love was caught stealing candy bars and its sweetness taken from it. King Judah dreams. He has captured Queen Leslie and dotes upon her pink breasts. He sighs himself into the shadows between her thighs and never so soft. Never so soft. Oh, King Judah dreams. He crawls into Queen Leslie's womb. He curls up and cries like a newborn child. Oh, the lullaby. King Judah, King Judah, you've slept till the day. And what will you do when your son's gone away? King Judah groans. He cries with the coming of the light. The day breaks over him like a cold green wave. An eyelash in the soup, that is what you are to me, love, and the plot thickens. A musty cupboard, that is what you are to me, love, a dream I haven't opened. An unmade bed, that is what you are to me, love, a battlefield of fear and fashion. You're a Texas longhorn, love, crossing the great divide. You're a heifer in my garden, love, eating the weed. My love. You are like a frying pan I can't keep clean. We get hot and you begin to burn. My love, you are like the late, late show. Dreams we had before we were born. My love, you are like the weeds in my garden. Every time I give you a tug, I feel the roses frown.
King Judah rages. He takes away the Volvo and gives the guard a VW. He takes away the Mercedes and gives the second guard a Fiat. He has the third guard thrown in the dungeon for aspiring to a Maserati. Order has come back to the kingdom. King Judah rages. And the birds drop their banners. They sing as they used to sing. The kingdom has recovered its balance. The economy has come to its senses. Nothing can shake King Judah now. He has lost all he has to lose. King Judah rages. She sucked the blood from his mouth so he could breathe. He hurt his heart, carrying her away from the wreck. Love is the permanent revolution. Mm. It can't stand institutions. Love is life, finding its voice. I want the one who says, Yes! Who do you think you are, God, to give me life? Don't fight your body. It's all you've got. Queen Leslie rises like a pillar of salt. She has seen God but turned her back on him. She rises like a cake, like a loaf of bread. She has all the plumpness of a crumpet. Queen Leslie has decided to invade the invader. She takes tea and gives her general two lumps. Oh, not all the chainsaws in Siberia can stop her now. Couples, couples, couples everywhere. In the streets, the alleys, the movies, on the grass. They pass in automobiles, flying in airplanes, advertising dishwashers. Railroad cars couple, and a hook and eye couples. Couples, 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 each holding on to the other, fighting or laughing or drinking or thinking, my God, you go to a party to have a little fun, to meet someone, and what happens? Nothing happens. Because all the couples, even when they pretend to talk to you, are talking to each other. You thought you caught an innuendo, an invitation to go out in the backyard and look at the petunias. No, it was just Mary and John really speaking to each other about something else they'd done. And the language they use. Honey, baby. Yes, it gets wet and sticky. Bossy, marshy, poopsy, whoopsie. I said something wrong. Time for another fight. And there they go into the bathroom to talk it over. And the rest of us hang around kind of embarrassed because we all want someone to go into the bathroom with. But we're all women or all men. Or if we're women and men together, we feel like boxcars on different gauge railways. Couples, 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 you see them everywhere. In ads, trash cans, streetcars, bars. Something in this world doesn't love the singular. It takes two to tango or eat a mango. Yes, you see them everywhere. Happy, but a little worse for wear. Queen Leslie mixes potions in the kitchen. She wavers among the vapors like a Walt Disney witch and catapults her cries over the walls against the distant city. It is the beginning of a great battle, and there is no answer but to be the victor. Washington is on the hotline. Is there nothing they can do? Istanbul replies, I've never seen anything like it. In San Francisco, rats in the streets have died for less. There is a lack of communication with Buenos Aires, and Santiago de Chile is under siege. I think we'd best be thinking about getting out, but there is no out to get.
Love is in the <laughs> Love is a case of mistaken identity. Love is when two people fail to recognize they've fallen into a photograph. <laughs> Love is losing your marbles to a better player. Love is standing on a bridge, kissing the wind as a train rumbles under you. Love is a box top and two bits. Love is a spitball which, when unrolled, says, This is it, kid. Love is lying awake at night listening to the mice dancing at the cookie jar. Love is a streetcar you tried to catch, caught, got off, and forgot. Love is a movie with Ava Gardner, Lana Turner, and Mitzi Gaynor doing handstands to a tuba. Love is a reflection in a plate glass window. You try to buy and find out it's too late. Love is an eyebrow pencil, fingernail clippers, hair tonic, contact lenses. Love is a spinning record that says, check your telephone directory for the correct listing. Love is mother bending over the baby you never were. Love is the legend of your birth from a volcano, and there's no turning back. Love is the woman whose feet you planted in cement and watered with a river. Love is the man who done you wrong, and you shot him down. Love is an old piano, and the only tune it plays is, Pass the apples, Rosie, I've just begun to spit. Love is a moonbeam, slightly out of focus, a laser that detaches the retina, a match that lights up your hopes and burns out your second story. Love is something children ask about and parents lie about. And grandparents ask if that is what happened. Love is a ticket stub from Grand Old Opry. A Cupid doll from the greatest show on earth. Hmm. Love is something you do when you've done everything else and found that wasn't enough. Love. Queen Leslie punches her computer. It looks like a sure thing. Paris takes a short circuit and tries to make something out of it. Okay, cries Kathmandu. I can do it too. Another hat falls in the ring. UFO, cries Leslie. Understand your fucking objective. Hmm. Mediators come crawling out of the cracks. They look a little dusty. They look a little rusty. The best thing about dying is you don't need to worry about the future. The best thing about dying is you can relax. The best thing about dying is all your friends bring you flowers and feel sorry for themselves, though it looks like they are crying for you. The best thing about dying is not having to pay the last payments on your car, and boy, did you put one over on him. The best thing about dying is not having to make a speech at the next PTA meeting, and boy, are they going to be surprised. The best thing about dying is that goddamn dishwasher you bought ten years ago, and it never did work right. The best thing about dying is goodbye, you son of a bitch. The best thing about dying is not having to regret not having married the one you love instead of the one who suited you. The best thing about dying is the kids. The best thing about dying is getting all this nice attention. The best thing about dying is being the star you always wanted to be. Queen Leslie sprays with black flag and isn't afraid to say so. The queen is in her kitchen, killing cats and rats. Okay, says Lima, if that's the way you want it. And Peru pitches Panama into the vat. The sun comes up glowing all over, like me without my clothes. An abortion is like a bellows. It heightens the fire while squeezing you to death. I put away the letters and pictures for fear of feeding my fantasies. He's learning, she said, but what about the right things? I lay in my bed and felt my bones. My body would not change much before I died. One minute you smell like a desert, the next like a sea. 
Time to take a vacation. Time to get away. It wasn't his attitude, I minded. It was the woman he was with. The morning after, I felt like hell. It wasn't her I minded, but him. They claim we went from innocence to decadence without a pause on the plateau. They burned our bodies, but our hearts glowed like two coals, like two eyes. The moon trying to climb out of the arms of a tree. Pigeons attacking statues. Trash burns in the barrel. They burned our bodies, but our hearts glowed like two coals, like two eyes. What are the police there for? To protect people in houses? They don't like lovers. Lovers might do anything. Burn down houses. Dance in the ashes. Skip town. No. They don't like lovers. Lovers never live in houses. Your eyes are like paradise. Deep and green. Home from shipwreck. The sailor asks after his wife. The stones in the wall begin to bleed. The palms of his hands open with mouths. The boards of the fence buckle and tweet. The tea kettle whistles off pitch. And the dish towel denies it has ever been clean. Your eyes are like paradise. Deep and green. Do you know the story of Tam Lin? Tam Lin has been captured by the spirit world and every night goes riding with the ghosts. He tells his love how to recognize him by his silver buckle and white hat. She must grab him as they go by and hold on no matter what he becomes. This she does. And she has a dragon in her arms spouting fire, then a wave green and twisting, then a knife that threatens to cut her to the heart. This goes on all night until the dawn when Tam Lin becomes himself free to be human. This is all I want from you, my love. Hold on until the dawn. Truth. Beauty. The moon wearing away to a spindle. <laughs> you, love, like a fire in my arms. I can't get over this world no matter how hard I try. For you, I'd sharpen all the pencils in the Pentagon. For you, I'd walk a camel a mile. For you, I'd eat ice cream the flavor of asphalt. For you, I'd paint every leaf in the jungle purple. For you, I'd put out the sun with my water pistol. For you, just for you. For you, I'd smuggle Samsonite into China. For you, I'd put a red flag on the Washington Monument. For you, I'd violate every statute in the park. For you, I'd run for the president and keep running. For you, I'd displease the deposed king of Greece. For you, just for you. Only for you. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, friends. Thanks for listening.